buying a property including a house is the dream of every person. This is the reason why real estate is still the first choice of people for investment. According to a report by investment banking company Joffrey's, nearly 50% of Indian households have invested in real estate. If you also want to invest in real estate but you do not have lakhs and crores of rupees, then you don't have to worry. You can start investing in real estate with just 300 to 400 rupees. But how? Let us tell you. Real Estate Investment Trusts or REITs provide an option to invest in the real estate market without buying property. They invest in income generating commercial properties such as office space, business parks and shopping malls. REITs earn regular income from this investment in the form of rent. They have to invest 80% of their assets in rental property. Now the question must be arising in your mind that how REITs work. Suppose a company named ABC has opened a trust. It will raise money from mutual funds and invest in properties that are put on rent. Investors will get returns only from this earning. Apart from this, the value of the property in which one has invested also increases. He will also benefit from this. Investors get units on investment in REITs. REITs have to pay 90% of rental income as dividend or interest to unit holders. Now what are the benefits of investing in REITs? First, investing in REITs gives you the ownership of property even by investing a very small amount. Second, you just have to invest money. From collecting the rent to paperwork, the company that has brought the REIT will do everything. A huge amount is required to buy a property whereas it is not so in REITs. One unit can be bought in the stock market for 350 to 400 rupees. The more units you buy, the higher will be the return. Just like equity, it can also be sold immediately to get back the money. Whereas it usually takes a longer time to sell a property. Like shares, REITs are listed and traded on the stock market. To invest in REITs, one needs to have a DMAT and trading account. The unit prices fluctuate in the stock market depending on REITs performance and demand. Currently, three REITs are listed on the stock market. These are Embassy Business Park, Mindspace Business Park and Brookfield, India. In order to attract small investors, SEBI changed the rules of REIT in 2021. Earlier, the minimum investment amount in REITs through IPO and follow-on offer was 50,000 rupees. SEBI has reduced this to 10,000 to 15,000 rupees. Along with this, the minimum trading lot after listing has been reduced from 100 to 1. That is, even one unit can be bought and sold on stock market. SEBI registered investment advisor Jitendra Solanki explains that buying commercial property is a very expensive deal. In comparison, investing in a real estate infrastructure trust is economical. If the REIT invests in premium commercial property, you can get returns of 10 to 12 percent. Of course, this is including rental dividend and capital appreciation. Also, real estate mutual funds are a good option for investing in the property market.